Welcome to another Down the Rabbit Hole video, and this is just a quick kind of a public service announcement. Uh, do you remember a few weeks ago I was in the Victoria Retro Game Store and I picked up this Virtual Fighter 5? Because as I mentioned when I talked about Ulala, -la, you can actually get a skin you can download for Virtual Fighter 5 and you can play as her if you take um, Sarah Bryant and you buy this DLC. Um, just wanted to let you know, it's not entirely true. Uh, this Virtual Fighter 5 for the PlayStation 3 on disc is different from the game that has the Ulala -la costume. And um, I found that out the hard way, so I just wanted to let everybody else know. Uh, don't pick this up thinking that that's going to actually solve or, or provide to you the Ulala -la costume. Um, what happened is, so Virtual Fighter 5 came out in 2007, I think, something like that. And then I was reading up online for this costume. I thought, okay, well, if I pick this up, I can just get the costume, right? No. Um, it says online that this costume and a few others were released as part of um, Virtua Fighter 5 R update for Virtua Fighter 5. So I thought, okay, so you put your disc into your PS3, you update it, and you've got Virtua Fighter 5 R, right? No. Um, Virtua Fighter 5 R was only released in Japanese arcades, uh, so it's not like it's part of this particular game. I mean, it, it is very much the same kind of dynamics or mechanics, but it's not Virtua Fighter 5. You just update it on the PlayStation, uh, PlayStation 3. Um, what you need to do, in fact, uh, let me show you what happened. I, I actually bought this costume because I wanted to play Zulala, and I'll just show you what that actually looks like. So here we are in the PlayStation Store. I have searched for Virtua. There's Virtua Fighter 5 Final Showdown Complete Edition. That's the game that you can get. And in fact, if I scroll down the different uh, characters, here's all their different customized outfits. I'll go to Sarah Bryant. You can see right here, it says to download because I bought it. It was only five bucks and I thought, five bucks for the costume, seven bucks for the game. Hey, I'm gold. Um, no, this costume only works with Virtua Fighter 5 Final Showdown, not Virtua Fighter 5. Uh, so I'm just going to pop into the game here and show you that there's no actual... It's, it has been downloaded, it's on the hard drive, it's not there. So here we are, game is loaded, Virtua Fighter 5. Uh, let's see if I can actually pull up that DLC, but I know I can't. So if I go down here to customize, there's Sarah Bryant. I've given her the name Ulala. But if I go into her costume settings here and try to, I don't know, maybe edit or something. So now I've been through the customized options here and I know that normally the Ulala stuff would be selectable down there. You'd be able to change to the, the pink hairdo, uh, you'd be able to change the outfit to like the orange uh, tank top. All of these things should show up because I bought the DLC and I have downloaded it. They don't show up here because this is just Virtua Fighter 5. So like myself, don't be deceived when you see Virtua Fighter 5 down there and think, oh, I'll just get the disc and download the game and update it to Virtua Fighter 5R. That doesn't happen. Ulala's costume is only available for Virtua Fighter Final Showdown, Virtua Fighter 5 Final Showdown. It's not available for this game, so uh, I'll just save everybody five bucks there. It's too bad, I would have liked to have played that. Oh well, we'll see you down the rabbit hole.